to the channel. Thanks for stopping by. This is another Honest Flavour review and this is Advape Lemonade. <laughs> for Ad Vapes Blueberry Marshmallow Waffle. I hope you managed to catch that one. If not, I'll stick the link up there. Or is it up there? Never sure which way round it is, but I'll stick it up there for you anyway. Now, when I contacted Ad Vape uh, after trying a sample of the Blueberry Marshmallow and they sent me a bottle of the Blueberry Marshmallow Waffle to try, they also very kindly sent me a bottle of lemonade as well. Thank you, Advape, if you're watching, and I hope you are. Very, very much appreciated it is too. So, I believe that lemonade is one of Advape's best-selling juices. Now, Advape, if you haven't heard of Advape before, and it's quite possible you haven't, if you're not from the Midlands area or even more specifically the Worcester area, uh, Advape are an independent vape shop just outside of Worcester in St. John's. And um, they use a white label vape juice company for their branded juice. It doesn't matter who, I don't know who it is. All that matters is whether it tastes any good, right? So, a little bit about uh, the juice then. It is a 70-30 VGPG mix. You can purchase it off the website. It's $7.99, just $7.99 for 50 mil. And you get a free Nick shot too. Not bad. Now, when uh, Advape sent me the lemonade to review, they sent it with an iced nick shot. Now, I'm, whilst I am coming round to my iced flavours, I'm still not a massive fan. And when I asked Advape about it, I was told that most of their customers who order lemonade order it with the iced nick shot too. And that's why they sent me that. However, in the interests of fairness, what I did was I decanted 25 mil out of this and I put it into another empty Advape bottle. This was the empty bottle from uh, when Mr. Morris gave me a sample of the blueberry marshmallow waffle. Glad that I kept hold of it. So 25 mil in this, 25 mil in this. This one has got five mil of a nick shot in it. This one has got five mil of the iced nick shot in it. And I'm gonna give you my honest opinion of what each of them tastes like with and without ice. Again, in the interest of fairness, keeping it as fair as I possibly can, I'm using the same RDAs for both of these juices. Now, now the mods themselves differ, but on this side, we've got my absolutely wonderful, beautiful Dovpo Bassium Squonkin mod with a profile mesh RDA on top. In On this side, we've got my, uh, what's that, Geek Vape Aegis Max with another profile mesh RDA on top. Both remeshed, both re-wicked for the purposes of this review. I'm using next mesh strips in these. It's the 0 0.15 ohm strips, which are rated as between 50 and 70 watts. To be fair, on both of these, I've only got them up to 50 watts so far, and I honestly don't think they need to go any higher than that. So, let's give them a taste, shall we? We'll start with the non-iced version first. So, 0.15, well, in fact, it's reading as a 0.18, actually, ohm, 50 watts, let her rip, tater chip. That is really, really tasty juice. 
Now, the first thing that comes to mind when I bake this, and I don't even think you can buy them anymore, this is a bit of a sweet from my childhood, is a yellow, so lemon flavour, obviously, a yellow jelly tot. Do you remember those jelly tots? I think they were around trees. Um, a unique flavour all of their own and a, a unique texture jelly tots, weren't they? And I am reminded very, very much of the yellow lemon jelly tot sweets with this vape juice. Oh, it is really, really good. lemonade juice. It is almost fizzy. It's not quite a sherbet. Uh, you may have seen I reviewed the Sweet Vapes Lemon Sherbet recently. I'll stick that link up there somewhere for you too. Um, so not quite as, as fizzy as sherbet, but it definitely has got a fizz to it and you would definitely say it's lemonade. If somebody did the blindfold test of this uh, and just tasted the juice, I guarantee you you'd say, yeah, that's lemonade. But for me, it tastes more like a yellow lemon jelly top sweet, and that's that's a good thing. Loads of vapor production with this juice. I don't know how much of it is the juice and how much of it is the RDA, or what I would say. Cool. Next mesh, these mesh strips are banging in this little RDA. So what I will say is that even though this is the non-iced version of the lemonade, it is still cold. Now, if you are used to really cold juices, if you like a really, really, really cold uh, juice, then on its own, maybe not for you. For those of you who don't often vape cold juices, this might be enough on its own without the iced nick shot because it definitely is cold and the more you vape it the colder it gets but that's a really tasty juice really tasty juice Okay, so let's move it on to the other one, which is the same juice in the same RDA with the same mesh and the same wick, albeit on top of the, uh, the Aegis Max. Actually, I don't know if it looks a little bit silly on top of that. It's quite a big top to that uh, mod, isn't it? I'm not sure it's best suited to it, but it will do the job. I've taken the squonk pin out of the RDA, don't want it leaking down into the mod, but 0 0.18 ohms, um, 50 watts. This is the iced shot version. Let it rip, tater chip. Fuck me, that's cold. I feel like my throat has been cryogenically frozen. Oh my God. I really do feel like I've just been kicked in the face by Mr. Freeze. Iceman cometh. Wow, that's cold. It's really bloody cold. Okay, so what about flavor? What about taste? Well, I do think, or for me personally at least, and as we all know, flavors, taste is subjective, is it not? But for me, even though I'm not a massive, massive fan of icy cold juices, it's not the same. 
it's, uh, you know, if you really, really like an iced, iced, iced cold juice, then give it a go, uh, because it is mighty, mighty bloody cold. Um, and you can definitely still taste the flavour of the juice, but the more you vape it, the more you lose that taste of the lemonade, or in this case, as, as I've likened it to, the lemon jelly top sweet. I think that it's, for me anyway, perfectly cold enough without the iced shot in it. Um, and I think you get a lot more of the lemon flavour. It's a lot sweeter, it's a lot, it's got a lot more texture, which I know sounds ridiculous when we're talking about vapour. It's not a physical thing, is it? It's a gas. Um, so, but you do get texture with certain vape juices, don't you? And it coats your mouth and it gives you aftertaste and all that kind of stuff. And I think you get more of that with the standard non-iced version. Now I I've been hitting both of these quite hard and I'm starting to lose a little bit of flavour, starting to get a bit of a dry hit. So I'm gonna have to re re drip. When the crowd say ball selector, make sure I get in the right way around. Right then, so I've gone for the re re drip. When the crowd say ball, ball, ball. Let's give them both another go, shall we? Cue the music. That's really, really tasty. When you exhale through the nose with the iced one, more of the lemon does come out. You do actually get a bit more flavour than you do just from exhaling through the mouth. On the non-iced version, exhaling through the nose is around about the same as it is exhaling through the mouth. It's just really, really lemony, really, really sweet. You get a lot more of the citrus flavour from the iced one when you exhale through the nose. Either way, this, or should I say, either way, this is really really fucking good juice. So if you like citrus flavors, if you like it sweet, if you like it tangy, if you like it citrusy, uh, you like it lemony snicket, give these juices a go. I mean, they're 7.99 for 50 mil and you get a free nick shot. Really, really good. Uh, Advape, uh, I don't know who your supplier is of these juices, uh, but they are getting it really right. At least with the two that I've tried so far, the lemon and the blueberry marshmallow waffle, they are absolutely getting it right. Um, so, absolutely recommended. Let me ask the questions that I always do. Will I smash the rest of these bottles? And yes, I absolutely will. Uh, not so sure I'll keep on going back to the iced version, but the standard lemonade with the standard nicotine in it, it is full on flavor. It really is smack you in the face flavor. It is wonderful juice. Um, it's nice and sweet, it's not too overly citrusy, it's not overly sharp, just a really, really refreshing juice. This one, if you like it cold, um, and some do like it cold, give it a go as well. Not necessarily to my taste, but it is very, very, very good juice. Would I buy it again? And I absolutely would. I, like I just said, I don't think I'd buy the ice shot to go with it. I think it is plentiful. Um, as it, is, as it is with a standard Nick shot. Will it become one of my all-time favorites? Oh, wow. 
do you know what? It just might, it is that good. Get on the website, advape.co.uk, just as it sounds, advape.co.uk. Uh, I'm informed by Advape that not all of the juices that they, that they do that are branded as Advape in, a, in 50 mil are on the website, but you could give them a call if you were and, and find out what the other flavours are. As it stands right now, there are nine flavours available of their own branded juice on their website, so give it a look. If these two flavours that I've done tonight are anything to go by, they are all going to be very, very good juice. So that about wraps it up. Advape, thank you very, very much for sending me the juice for the purposes of review. I am really, really enjoying these juices and I'm glad that uh, Mozza gave me a sample and introduced me to your juices. Um, I'd like to review more. Maybe we can chat and I can do some more reviews for you because these are really, really pucker juices. I shouldn't say pucker juice, should I? They're already a brand name. <laughs> um, whoops. Um, but they are very, very good. So, let's give them a score out of 10. Let's give it, Lemonade, a score out of 10. Well, I can't fault it, to be quite honest. I don't know how they could make it any better than it already is. You know, there's not a lot more to say. I've got to say, it's a 10 out of 10. It is outstanding juice. So, thank you for tuning in. This has been another Honest Flavour Review from The Vaping Mods. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you go out and check out this juice because it really, really is worth it. I will catch you for another honest review soon, whether it be hardware or juice. Until that time comes, do take care of yourselves. Do take care of each other. Love to you all. Peace.